might be specific disease retreat. Those things may matter. Um, but the other thing and that we need to pay attention to in agriculture is it's the resistance issue isn't just about resistance that's occurring in people, right? We also use antibiotics to maintain animal health. And so um, when we use those, we also have the potential to promote resistance in the bacteria that we're concerned about. So you mentioned bovine respiratory disease earlier in the podcast. <clears throat> um, certainly we've reported it and some other people have reported it too, that we are seeing antibiotic resistance in pathogens that cause respiratory disease in cattle. So uh, we, we just want to make sure that our use is consistent with trying to maintain the efficacy of antibiotics for as long as possible. So that, and again, I, I'm not, I'm not trying to be on the fence and not give direct answers, but that's really the state of where our scientific knowledge is, is there's a lot of things we don't know. And so we try to sort out what we do, what we don't, and what is the best use that's consistent with what we think right now. <laughs> 